What's up, guys? It's the Real Bender here. I'm here to talk about uh, Sony's Amy Pascal has just confirmed that that Venom is set in the MCU. In an interview for the Amazing Spider-Man: Homecoming, her and Kevin Hot, Kevin Feige were, sitting, were talking, and Ke- Amy Pascal said, "Yes, the Venom movie exists as we're building for Spider-Man: Homecoming. It is Venom." Black Cat and Silver Sable movie, they all exist in the MCU. But what's kind of funny about this is the way Kevin Feige looks at uh, Amy Pascal. He kind of just looks at her like, like, lady, what are you talking about? Like, he just looks at her kind of funny. Um, Amy, it's kind of, because kind of conflict conflicts with reports that uh, happened like a week ago, a week or two ago. And what Kevin Feige says, there are no plans to introduce the amazing introduce Venom to the MCU. So maybe the plan changed. Or maybe this was the plan all along. I mean, they never definitively said Venom was in the MCU. It's more just an assumption because it was rated R and it, and it, uh, it just, Sony was doing it. It just seemed like it was just going to be its own different thing. But now we sort of had confirmation that Venom is in the MCU. Um, my thoughts are, it's I'm kind of happy. Like, it, it just feel weird to have Venom without Spider-Man. You know, the, the emblem on the chest. You know, you know the, the way Venom as a character would be weird to not have Spider-Man there. You know, with the gigantic emblem on his chest. So, oh, but. It makes me think, like, how long was this a thing? Like, maybe they maybe Marvel, because I remember Marvel said you would like to try rated R films at some point, but that's not in the immediate future. Or maybe this Venom movie is the way to test it out to maybe see if if it will work. If it does, doesn't, we just put a plug on it. But if it doesn't end up working, maybe we'll try more rated R movies in the future. So, but yeah, overall, I think. This is really a smart move for Sony and a smart move for Marvel. And it, cause it, it just seemed weird to not have Venom exist in a world where Spider Man is. But overall, overall, I think it's a good move. But what, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. Like, comment, subscribe, and 5,000 subscribers. Peace.